Hey, what's up fam? So in this video, I'm going to be going over seven different ways that you can earn $10,000 per month working online. Now I have a lot of friends. My entire network is people earning seven, eight and nine figures online. And I'm going to be showing you the seven different methods that you can use. These are the best business models you can possibly go after. And I've actually done five of them to earn over $10,000 a month. And I'll show you how you can as well. You won't want to miss number six. Let's get it. So the first business model that I actually started earning $10,000 a month with was marketing agency. Now this is actually a great way to start as an online business person because you get to learn on OPM, other people's money. So how I was able to quit my job was I actually was a marketing agency. In 2012, I was working for a marketing agency. I was getting paid $6,000 a month, but I quit because I was able to get my own clients, my own marketing clients to overall pay me over $10,000 per month. I was making more on the side than I was for my job. I quit my job. So that was how I first got started. And it's a very easy way. You do marketing for other people. And that can be graphic design, that can be managing ads, that can be doing Facebook ads, Google ads, that can be putting up websites or blog posts, web design, web development. There are all sorts of things. And you don't need any technical knowledge to do any of this. You don't need any college degree. All you need to do is be good at reaching out to people, meeting people, and have a service of value to provide for others. Now the next business model which I did, which was able to earn me over $10,000 per month is affiliate marketing. Now what affiliate marketing is, is affiliate marketing is selling other people's products and earning a commission. So the difference between running a marketing agency is you're getting paid a flat fee in most cases for providing a service. Whereas affiliate marketing, you can get paid anything. You're paid purely on results and how many customers, how many app installs, how many leads that you send to a particular business. Now I was able to scale my affiliate marketing business to doing hundreds of thousands of dollars per month. And if you Google me, you'll find a Forbes article that details, it's back in 2015 or 16, how I was able to make over $500,000 a month with affiliate marketing. Pretty cool. Okay, so the next business that I dabbled in is consulting, okay? And that's the C. Consulting is where you get paid to advise other businesses about a particular subject that you are an expert in or you simply have more knowledge than they do in. So now the main difference between consulting and running a marketing agency is where you're running a marketing agency, you are actually providing a service for the client. Whereas when you're doing consulting, you are simply just advising the client or the business owner on what they should do. You're sort of like a coach. Now what's great about consulting is that there's zero costs associated with it. If you are an expert in whatever field you're in, then and people are willing to pay you just for your brain or just to talk with you once a week or once a month, then you're making all of that money without any costs whatsoever. Now, the reason I did consulting was sort of simple. It was because people were messaging me all the time and asking if I could advise them on what marketing agencies they should hire or how they get into affiliate marketing or how they set up an affiliate marketing program. And they offered to pay me some pretty good money. I was able to make over $10,000 a month doing this. The reason I stopped consulting is because it took a lot of my time. The clients, the business owners that paid me constantly wanted more and more and more time to speak with me and to help them out in their business. Now the next business I went into was I tried to put my knowledge down in a video course and systemize my knowledge. I realized that people respected me for being a good affiliate marketer, but I didn't want to pay the be on phone calls and get in meetings every single week and every single month. So what I did next was I did number four. 
a digital product. A digital product is basically a training course. It's an educational course teaching people about a particular subject. In my case, I was teaching people how to do affiliate marketing because people, again, they were willing to pay me up to $10,000 a month to teach them about affiliate marketing. So I figured, okay, why not just make a digital product so I save all of my time. I give the clients who wanna pay me a cheaper price because it's all just on videos. That way, instead of having to repeat the same things over and over again, it's already on a video course. I still sell digital products to this day. It's actually a large part of my business and I really enjoy teaching. And it's part of the reason why I have this YouTube channel because it allows me a way to help teach others and I get a lot of students and I'm able to see a lot of success stories and a lot of change in people's lives. I personally believe that digital products and digital education is the future of business education around the world and I'm hoping to be at the forefront of that. Now this business also currently makes me over $500,000 a month right now. So the next business that I've gotten into which I'm currently developing and we currently are doing revenues of over $10,000 a month already is software. Now my software isn't actually created yet. I've pre-sold my software for, because people are interested in buying my software before it's created. It's essentially like click funnels for ads. It's a marketplace so you can easily post ads to and copy ads that are working to Facebook, Google, and YouTube. And that's the next big business that I'm going into, but we're not doing that much money yet. We're, we just have a few, you know, about 80 different customers right now that are trialing our software. This next business is one I haven't actually done before, but I know plenty of people that are making hundreds of thousands, millions, even tens of millions of dollars a year doing it. And in fact, you'll be working with one of the biggest companies in the world if with this business model. It's called Amazon FBA. Now what Amazon FBA is, is you are selling products on Amazon and FBA stands for Fulfillment by Amazon. So when you have a product, let's say this marker that you are selling on Amazon, you would ship a hundred or a thousand of these marketers to Amazon's warehouse and they would do all the packaging, the shipping, the fulfillment, the box stuffing, everything for you and all you're responsible to do is order the product from China, ship it to Amazon's warehouse and list the product on Amazon's site. Now, if you're interested in learning more about Amazon FBA and you want to start a business with Amazon, then what you should actually do is subscribe to my channel, enable notifications so you can catch my live streams. And there's a free mini course from my friend Tanner J. Fox in the free mini courses area, which is four videos long and it'll teach you about how you can figure out what product you can, you know, you should start with on Amazon, how you should sell it, and how you can use this business model to make a lot of money. He's currently making a little over $100,000 a month with Amazon FBA. He's a pretty smart guy to learn from. The last business model is an interesting one. It's networking. And no, I'm not talking about network marketing, although maybe it's sort of similar. But what I'm talking about is hosting masterminds and bringing together people from various industries. I actually recently joined a networking group. It's a mastermind group. Um, called the $100 million Mastermind, and it costs $100,000 a year to join. But the benefit of being in it is I have access to people and other business owners who are doing $100 million a year. You know, they want motivated, you know, people that are interested in learning from them. Now, this business model is was talked about recently by Tony Robbins, and I don't know if anybody saw the launch that Tony Robbins did with Dean Graziosi and Russell Brunson, but it was a huge launch and Tony Robbins has his own networking group called the Platinum Partnership. I believe that, you know, kind of as a lone wolf internet marketer, you know, many people are running businesses all over the world nowadays and there's no singular place to bring people together. I believe helping people come together in masterminds or groups or conferences or conventions is a great way to start a business. And networking doesn't just mean starting a mastermind. It can be starting a conference, starting a, a forum, starting an event that brings people from many sides of the world together and helps them learn from each other. So these are the seven business models that you can do to earn 
$10,000 a month or more. As I showed you, five of them I've done myself and two of them are notables. I hope this helps you out. If you could let me know in the comments below, which of these business models did you find the most interesting? Was it marketing agency, affiliate marketing, consulting, digital agency, software, Amazon FBA, or networking? Let me know in the comments which is the most interesting to you and I'm gonna try to do a deeper dive into that business model in future videos. And as always, make sure to slam that subscribe button, enable those notifications. If you wanna watch live streams or live Q and A's with me, give this video a thumbs up and looking forward to seeing you in future videos. Share this video with somebody else if you want to help them get their start in online business by helping them learn the seven big models of starting an online business.